हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू आर चैनल टुडे वी आर प्रेजेंटिंग क्लास थ्री चैप्टर वन लिविंग एंड नॉन लिविंग थिंग्स सो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल वी हैव दिस टेबल वी हैव डिफरेंट थिंग्स हेयर कार कैट विंडो बुक हाउस एंड ए लेडी सो वी हैव टू आंसर डिफरेंट क्वेश्चन सो लेट एस डू वन बाई वन वी हैव first question does it breathe so for car it doesn't breathe so we put a cross here cat do breathe so we put a tick mark here so we put a cross for no and tick mark for yes so window do not breathe book house do not breathe and a lady breathe next question does it move on its own car cannot move so we put a cross mark cat can move on its own window book and house do not move on its own a lady can move on its own so we put a tick mark here next question is does it eat so car do not eat so we put a cross mark cat can eat window do not eat book do not eat house do not eat a lady eats so we put a tick mark next is does it respond when touched car do not respond cat responds window do not respond book do not respond we put a cross mark here house do not respond a lady respond so next is can it produce its own kind so car do not produce its own kind cat can produce window house and book do not produce whereas lady can produce its own kind so we can see we have most of the question yes in case of cat and lady and in other things like car window book and house we have cross mark so this is the first page let us move to the second page so in second page we will see what are living and non living things living and non living things living things need food and water they move grow feel and produce their own kind non living things do not need food and water they do not move grow feel or produce their own kind some example of living things a tree an elephant non living things ke examples hain a car a toothbrush all living things are natural they cannot be made by humans whereas some non living things are natural others are made by humans non living things which are made by humans are known as human made things for example cars toys roads and buildings they are called human made or man made things some natural non living things are sun cloud etc and human made non living things a bed a phone a car etc now we have checkpoint 1 meet hershey hershey is a fun loving dog and meet jacob jacob is a stuffed toy identify the things that hershey the dog can do while jacob the toy cannot one is done for you hershey can run whereas jacob cannot run so we can write hershey can eat whereas jacob cannot eat Hershey can breathe whereas Jacob cannot breathe Hershey can play whereas Jacob cannot play because Hershey is a living thing and Jacob is a non living thing Now next let us see differences between living and non living things 
all living things have some characteristics that make them different from non living things let us learn about them one by one first is living things need food and water living things ko food and water ki zarurat hoti hai all living things need food to live food give them energy to do various activities it keeps them healthy and helps them grow green plants can make their own food using sunlight water and air on the other hand animals cannot make their own food they eat plants or other animals so we can see a plant growing in sunlight a jackal eating the flesh of another animal and a girl eating food non living things do not need food for example table chair etc do not need food now next living things breathe so this is next property all living things need air to breathe if there is no air living things will die living things have special organs for breathing so let us see one by one for humans humans breathe through their nose we can see in this picture air travels through their nose into the windpipe and then to the lungs like in picture land animals like cats dogs horses and zebras also have lungs for breathing insect like grasshopper as we can see in the picture breathe through the tiny pores known as spiracles present on their body so we can see a grasshopper have breathing holes called spiracle inko spiracles kehte hain whereas in human we have nose for breathing and it goes through windpipe or lungs mein air jati hai so living things breathe whereas non living things do not breathe now aquatic animals jo pani mein animals rehte hain like fish they have gills these gills help them take in oxygen dissolved in water so we can see a fish having gills plants breathe through tiny pores called stomata to isko stomata kehte hain present on the underside of leaves plants have stomata as we can see in the picture non living things do not breathe next property living things move non living things do not move plants and animal differ in the types of movement they show plants are fixed to the soil with their roots and do not move from one place to another however some plants may move their parts for example the touch me not mimosa plant close its leaves upon touching as we can see in the picture leaves of touch me not plant close when touched so plants ki movements differ karti hain animal se but they also move animals move on their own from one place to another in search of food and shelter or to protect themselves from their enemies some animals like cats and cows move with their legs birds and insect fly with the help of their wings fish move with the help of their fins and tail snakes and earthworms move with the help of their whole bodies scales and body movements respectively so as we can see movement in a bird using its wings movement in a fish using its fins and tail whereas non living things do not move on their own as we can see in this picture a bird is using its wings to move A fish is using its fins and tail similarly humans and animals use their legs the three toed sloth is the slowest moving animal in the world so non living things do not move on their own next property living things feel and respond to their surroundings what do you do when you feel hungry how do you come to know that someone is knocking at the door because we can hear when you get hurt do you feel pain all living things feel so living things can feel and respond to their surroundings so living things can feel with the help of sense organs the five sense organs are eyes ears nose skin and tongue just like animals plants can also feel we should not harm them 
a dog uses its nose to sniff and a cat cleans itself using its tongue non living things do not feel anything so they do not respond for example a table chair bed etc they do not respond to any touch think of other animals that use their sense organ to perform specific tasks now next property living things grow whereas non living things do not grow you must have seen your photograph when you were a small baby you were much smaller than what you are today living things change their shape and size as they grow so all living things take birth grow become old and die as we can see in the picture a baby girl grows into a woman a seed grows into a plant and then tree a cub grows into a tiger so living things grow whereas non living things do not grow now next property living things reproduce living things have the ability to give birth to their own kind this process is called reproduction some animals like birds and tortoises lay eggs these eggs hatch and baby comes out of each egg some animal give birth to young ones for example cats horses monkeys and humans give birth to young ones so living things reproduce their own kind whereas non living things do not reproduce we can see a mother with her baby a hen with its eggs and a horse with its foal so these are their babies so these are living things plants produce seeds which grow into a baby plant under suitable conditions this baby plant grows to become a new plant as we can see in the picture when a seed is sown into soil in the presence of warmth water and air it grows into a plant and then tree so this is a living thing which of the following characteristics is shown by both living and non living things so first is growth reproduction and then weight growth and reproduction are shown only by living things weight is shown by both living as well as by non living so weight is the answer a car moves when we start the engine is the car a living or a non living thing so car do not move on its own so it is a non living things because living things move on its own have you ever seen your football bicycle laptop or bus producing more of their own kind no this is because non living things do not reproduce so this is another property that living things produce and non living things do not reproduce we have checkpoint 2 fill in the blanks one is done for you bird is a living thing whereas a rock is non living thing grasshopper has spiracles for breathing and nose is for human so human breathes through their nose birds have wings to fly or move whereas fish move by using their fins and tails horse has fall as hen has eggs horse give birth to fall hen lay eggs cub grow up into a tiger and plant grow up from seed so seed grow up into a plant and cub grow up into a tiger now let us complete the following table living things need food to live and grow whereas non living things do not need food to live and grow so we have this differentiation between living and non living things second non living things do not breathe whereas living things breathe third non living things cannot move from one place to another on their own living things can move from one place to another on their own 
living things can feel fourth is living things can feel whereas non living things do not feel fifth non living things do not grow whereas living things grow sixth living things reproduce non living things do not reproduce now we have keyword we have studied so far spiracles tiny air holes or pores present on the bodies of insects that help them to breathe stomata pores present on the underside of leaves through which they take in and give out air sense organs organs that enable us to sense changes around us they are eyes ears nose skin and tongue reproduction the process by which living things give birth to their own kind now we have summary in nature there are two kinds of thing we have studied so far living and non living living things need food and water they move grow feel and produce their own kind non living things do not need food and water they do not move grow feel or produce their own kind all living things are natural whereas non living things can be natural as well as man made so now we have exercise objective type question tick the correct answer first is which of the following is a natural thing pen mobile phone brush moon we have moon is a natural thing so d option is correct second which animal moves with the help of its whole body deer monkey earthworm lion so earth is the right option earthworm move with the help of its whole body which organ does a grasshopper breathe through so lungs spiracle nose and gills so grasshopper breathe through spiracles which of the following does not give birth to young ones hen lay eggs so it does not give birth to young ones next is which of the following does not reproduce car bird tortoise and tiger so car does not reproduce because it is a non living thing next is match the following table human made thing tongue is a sense organ humans have lungs to breathe and fish have gills to breathe whereas leaves use stomata to breathe in air next question name the organs of breathing in fish use their gills to breathe in insect use their spiracles to breathe in whereas plants use stomata to breathe in and humans use lungs or nose to breathe in and jumble the letters and define the words so first is reproduction we can see reproduction reproduction producing of their own kind second is stomata stomata this is the part of plant which is used to take in air third is spiracles spiracles are used by insect to breathe in next is complete the concept map so we have things so two types of things living non living now living things can do these they can move they can grow second is grow third option is reproduction and fourth is feel so living things can feel now we have examples of living and non living things living things are cat dog etc non living things examples are car chair now next is short answer questions give any one difference between living things and non living things so we can say that living things can move on their own whereas non living things do not move on their own so this is the one difference between living and non living things they can move second is what are natural things natural things which are made by god are known as natural thing for example moon sun etc are natural things give two examples of natural non living things 
so we can say moon sun soil water etc are natural non living things fourth is the touch me not plant cannot move from one place to another is it a living thing or a non living thing why so we can say that plants use different movements but they are living things as we touch the touch me not plant it get closed up so it is a living thing now next is name some animals that lay eggs so we have hen lizard turtle etc which lay eggs how does a snake move snake move by using its whole body next are long answer question how can you say that living things feel living things respond to touch or they can feel as a human can feel hunger pain etc so living things feel second how does growth takes place in living things growth take place like we have seed grown into a plant a baby turned into a person big human so this is how what is reproduction give examples so reproduction is giving birth or producing their own kind for example a horse giving birth to the fall a cow giving birth to calf next is why do living things need food living things need food to grow and to survive so this is the end of the chapter if you like the video then please like and share the video and do subscribe our channel thanks for watching the video and keep watching for more such videos thank you